Kevin Hart. And as you know, I'm a comedic rock star. A part of living that rock star life is having a bunch of friends that are athletes. They're busy, I'm busy. Being there all so busy, the only way I can talk to these people is right here in this ice bath. Welcome to Coldest Balls. Today's episode is me and Lonzo Ball. What? What? We didn't get the sun? No! I told you I wanted the sun. He told us he was coming. I'm too big a star to talk to the dad. Put your towel down, man. Let's get in this water, man. Okay. Wait, we go, so we're going to go through the whole thing with the dad? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So now I got to change my questions and stuff up. Change it up, baby. I had a you... whole different thing prepared. Where is the sun? I told you he got business to do. He ain't got time to be sitting in no tub like this. You know what? I'm going to talk to you. Talk you want to you wanna have a conversation? Yeah, I, I, uh, heart to heart. My bad. Heart to ball. That's, that's not. Okay. Man up and put your feet up in there, man. All right. How many years did you play all four years in high school? I played all four. Oh, well, see, in high school, went from 10th grade. 10th grade. You don't even go four years. That was the perfect answer. Shoot. Did you play all four years in high school? What I did uh, uh, No, you only get three years in high school for us. What position did you play? Any position. Any position. You know what? A point guard told me, he said, LeVar, you know I'm the one who gets you the ball. Uh -huh. And you know what I told him? I'm the one who gets the goddamn rebound and give it to you to give it to me. <laughs> How's that? I like to be interviewed, man. Let's damn in it. Whoa, good lord. Get your ass in and let's do this. You all right? This kid is colder than I thought, man. Take mine right about here. You gotta come in a little more, man. Go just dive in it. Okay. Oh, boy. As a father with three sons that are all doing the same thing, they all have the same dreams and aspirations. Oh, yes. All of them, right? Yes, yes, yes. One of them boys may or may not make it. They all three gonna make Which it. Which one three of them. would you pick if you had to pick one? I ain't picking none of them. Which one do you love the least? I know which one you don't. I know which one I'll is your you least favorite. I bet you don't know which one is my least favorite. Shit. Tell me which one it is. It's the middle one. What? Jello? Yeah. Shit. That's the best one. You see how he built? He built. You know like why? Because he built like you. Ooh, you just told on yourself. Yes. The youngest one is your least favorite. You know what? <laughs> huh. He don't like his youngest son. Youngest son. He don't like his huh. youngest son. Yes. Ah! Look at you. There you go. Come on, jump on in there. I tried to psych myself up. It didn't work. Oh, man. Sorry. <laughs> one, three. You ready? Yes. One. One, three. Three. One. Boy, he's sh Boy, one. this preparation for this. Can you imagine you trying to dive off a diving board? Ooh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. You're good now, man. All right. See? How do you feel that your son is going to deal with this spotlight? The spotlight has not been on him like the NBA spotlight. You can't get to this level all of a sudden and be a superstar. You gotta be a superstar when you this little. I'm you gotta grow into that superstar. Lonzo been a superstar all his life, so this is nothing new. I'm following you. How do you handle LA? How does LA handle us? That's a great answer, actually. We've been like this all the time. That may be one of the best things that I've heard you say since you have been on TV. Wow. Because you done said some stupid are that you crazy? Are you crazy? No, some you stupid You said some stupid shit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Somebody got my sh hammered in. Oh, that was just your fat ass sitting oh, on it. Oh, ah. oh, shit. Oh, yeah. Huh? Hey, Hold on, man. Hold on. I'm stuck. All right, okay. Ready? How have you proven yourself to be honest? and get this trust that your kids have in you without having the athletic background. From day one, when your father look like me, you got to think he's better at everybody. Boy, you know I top my game, boy, 270 pounds. Jump through the through the buildings, through the walls, lift five, six hundred pounds. That's the part I'm talking see? about. We've never seen it. Then you're not gonna see it, cause time goes you on. Tell me there's no tape of you dunking no basketball. No tape. No tape. Nobody's got a VHS. No. They don't even got you smacking you got the a backboard. VHS. Nobody's got you tapping the backboard. Nobody's got you right. on a fast break. Where is the footage from this time? No footage needed. You're a liar! You know why no footage is needed? Why? Because of all the eyes that saw me do what I do, it's up here. High school number, quick. Uh, I can't even remember. God damn. High school number, you asked me high school? I was like 30 years ago! 
Uh, you've been asking me a lot of things, man. Mm-hmm. I'm going to ask you some little rapid action right here. Okay. How much are the ZO2s? Uh, I believe that they're $700,000. What? 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 Then you price them at $700,000. $495. Oh, yes. Nick, what is your deal? Every time you wrong, you getting some ice. I'm busting your ass as soon as I get out of here. Hey, man, all right, look. Let me get my hand Oh, you really going crazy. Listen, <laughs> I'm a Christian. I'm man enough to say, I was wrong and I'm sorry and I don't want no more ice. So if you could just take that bucket and just scoop out what you just put in, I feel like it'll make this situation a lot better and no harm, no foul. Just scoop out what you just put in. See? My dick is officially gone. Give me some more goddamn ice, man. Show him he don't want no more ice in his tub. Fill me up. See, that's the real deal. You don't feel that. What'd you name your fourth kid? My fourth kid? Yeah. If I had one, you know what his name would be? What what would his name be? The Greatness. Oh, gosh. What you think would happen if me and MJ played? Is there any way where I could take all the money that I have in life and put it on Michael Jordan? Yes, you could do that. I think Michael Jordan would win. You think he would win? Why? There's no tape of you ever doing anything. Who cares about the tape? Not only can you not beat Michael Jordan, but you can't beat me. Bring in them basketball hoops. Oh, you got the hoops? Yeah, I got hoops. Oh, man. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Welcome to my world. We playing cold as balls. Cold as balls! Basketball. Okay, look, we're gonna go best out of three. Ready? Same time. Same time! Ready? Let's One, go. Two, three. Cash money. Let's go, baby. Same time. See how I did that? Look at that! That's what I'm talking about. My, Give me the ball again. My elbow was in Your game ain't that tight. Do it again. Look at that. Okay? One Knocking more. down stuff. Shoot. Okay. This, this is for all This is for all the market. Right. You see you bet all your money on your house? Yes. Go ahead and see what you do now. Ten grand! Ten grand to a chair. Ten grand. Huh? I see what you're going to do. I don't Ooh, I like that. That's, that's, that's the difference. You know what I do? Guarantee I'm going to miss this. That's a tough guarantee. You know what? Because I'm a bad motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> that, that a big toy. That's what I'm talking about, baby. And I'm out this month. Man, you know what? Yeah. I got a roll. Ooh. Uh, yeah, man. Hey. Okay. Oh, All right. No! There's the chair! No, Jesus Christ. No. Did he just. No, don't. Give it the chair! No, I don't want. Give all that to chair! No. We out! What? Do we have anybody on production that could have stopped that? We didn't. We don't have nobody that saw him coming around the corner that treated our set like a strip club just now. Nobody's. Good job, guys. We're the best. I think that we can all say that we've learned a little more about LeVar Ball. Good for you, LeVar Ball. Hi, I'm Kevin Hart. And unless you hate laughter, click and subscribe. And if you do hate laughter, then you're a monster. Give me a hug. Ain't giving you shit. Y'all want to see me give him a hug? No, don't hit me. <laughs> there you go. How many angry faces of Cube have you seen making this movie? Oh, he just makes the same one over and over again. It's only one. True. He's yeah, only got one. He's only got one. One real long one. <laughs> like, what's the face that you would make if you just found out you won the lottery? Which- oh, oh, yeah, I got it. Okay, there you go. go. <laughs> What do you think of you? I got a hundred. Right? Yeah. Give us two. They might all look the same, but I got a (laughs) hundred. What's the face you're making love to the most beautiful woman in the world? What's that face? No problem. Got that one. Here you go. (laughs) (laughs) But now you cannot. Oh, yeah. Here go one. Here go one. Do you practice in the mirror? No, it's just, I think. It's what I think. What's up, man? Hey, you can't. Hey, hey, nice to meet you, Jordy. You, man. Take your seat. Oh, shit. Oh, damn it. Don't worry, don't worry. Jesus Christ. God, dude. Damn. Most time to get into some shit. Yeah, man. get it. Get your ass out the goddamn car, my cop. Get your ass out the car. Man, you, just you, just, you, just, you just messed up her rainbow leg. I don't like the way she looked at me. <laughs> I felt a lot of racism in that look, man. That's what you're doing in my streets? Huh? 
You want to move weight around here? <laughs> Dirt road. Yeah. <laughs> this guy's good. <laughs> this guy's good. This is a good criminal. Man. Look at me. Look, look at me. Man. Doc, brother, that's, you, man. I, first of all, I did that to man, show you what I can you do. You've been drinking. That's called, <laughs> that's called a donut, baby. That's your, that's your problem. You don't even know where we that's at. That's called right? an accidental donut. No, it's not. It's called, you can have to do it again. On purpose. Ready? Here don't we go. Come on, brother. <laughs> yeah, man. You saw it. That's what I'm talking about. What's up? You've ended up in the on the road, you, following the rules. Look at this. Look at this. You've nah, ended up in the, the field. Dirt, bro. Where you, where you That's what I'm saying, fields, man. Bro. Show me what that bitch can do. You're driving the wrong way, though, but don't, yeah, no, don't, don't, don't worry about Damn. it. Keep, just keep on going. Man, man. Let's go. The best detective. Oh, no, no. Oh, the best detective. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He just got on the joystick. Hold on, man. I ain't dead yet. Am I dead? Shut up. Why are you in war? I'm Lambo. driving to the army base, too. I'm in a Lambo. You're in war. You're in a swamp. I'm in a Lambo. I think, oh, I think wait, it's what? safe to say. It's a cliff. <laughs> what are you doing? Why? Why am I looking underneath the car? Because right I got chrome <laughs> under the hood, baby. <laughs> Right now, the manufacturer of the game should pop out and just go, what the fuck are you doing? Wrecking. Gamer. Gamer. Dude, are you mad because I'm a gamer? <laughs> do I look mad? You do look mad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was a oh, Cuba's mad. He's mad because I beat him in a video game. I mean, who, who cares? Man? It's, a, it's just a game. Look, if the video games play a big part in this movie, if you two came up head to head in, the in Call of Duty, for example, who do you reckon would come out on top? I would. I'd come out on top. I definitely would. Because if I was losing, I'd pull the plug. See, I'm that guy. <laughs> How do you pull out the plug, man? That's my thing. I snatch out the plug. I, that's how I win. Where the f***ing plug at? Someone needs to ride along with you. What are you looking for? What do you want when it comes to working with you? Gas money. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the, uh, the, the, the brake? Um, the handbrake? Hey, break. brother, you better know what the brake is. I'm Kevin Hart, bitch! Let's ride! Get up in here, okay. man! What is this? This is, this is, this is, uh, oh, loosen up! Loosen up! A little too tight in the ass. Look, Hold I'm on. not saying that I'm scared, because I'm not, but this ain't safe. <laughs> We've been on the for some time right now, and it looks like we selling ass. I mean, you... <laughs> You're going with Thomas in this one? Oh, sweet. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah. You like it? Yeah. What time's the wedding? <laughs> you ain't invited. <laughs> this is all right. Ah. Well, I think that's the only car where having like three black guys in a the car, they're not going to pull us over. Really? In this? Yeah. I feel like it's the complete opposite. Uh, no, they're crazy. Uh oh, yeah, oh they got no, man. Yeah, no. Run! Hey, we back in LA! Run! Watch out! Watch out! Q, get off and run! That's right! Okay, okay. Oh, oh shit. shit. Pull over. Police. Pull over. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to sleep. Pull over. No, 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 no. Fire department. Fire department. Oh, oh okay. All right. Regardless, don't we'll get hit. Don't get us killed. Nah, don't worry. You're going to get us pulled over. I brought some hot, hot coke. Yeah! Hot. Yeah, I bet you ain't got no hot cocoa in there, Q. Kevin ain't rocking the champagne. I can guarantee you that. Cheers to Cheers. Osmo. Cheers. They got hot Hello. chocolate and they smell horse butt. Yeah. Have you ever got robbed? Uh, no, not yet. All right, motherfucker. <laughs> okay, that's the sign. Ah! Oh. Ah! Hey. Ah! Oh, is it hot? Okay. Now, man, you cut us off, Jack. This penny had your name on it, man. Motherfucker. Riding along with the mean cop. Riding along with the mean cop. Riding along with the mean cop. Yo, me and Q just came from Mustafa's Gamoose Kebab, and it was the shit. Brother, what you doing with that window? Hey, man. Put some drawers on that window. Look, listen, bro. If we don't roll this window down, we're going to die from asphyxiation. Ooh, going to jail now. Oh my God, will you take a picture of us? I'm gonna put it on Instagram. Stop, stop. What? Do not take that picture. One, two, three. I'm gonna tag it two bad bitches on the uh, way with you. How do you think he treats my friend in uh, Limo? I think that's in the top two worst interviews that your friend has ever had in his life. <clears throat> Why? Because Cube is just going, yay, yeah, yay. Yeah. With Cube. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> I want to fill this Juniata with weed. Hey man, I thought you said we get more money for the third one, not less. 
That sound like a siren to you, Q? Kevin, shut up. You're such a diva. I told you we was undercover looking for the BMX bandits. Why are you get cool by Because I'm the cool one. I'm Ice Cube. Ain't nothing cooler than Q. Kevin Hart! Wait, I can't come down that fast, you. Well, I just got up here. I gotta show you something. This is gut wrenching cold yeah, weather right now. It's good. It's good. Yeah. It's fun. I don't feel bad. I'm gonna be honest with you. I can't feel my butt. Hey, hey, man. Where the limo at? We only rent that for one hour, so it's gone out. We take the we take the horses out. Out. Yeah. Oh. Hey, Nicole, get me. Hey, what? That don't look like Sorry. me. <laughs> Sorry, guys, Nicole said no. But I said yes. I said yes. That ain't no damn Nicole kid, man. So, you guys want to do jumps? Some on those. Can I spell Kevin? For the love of God, will you just shut up? Ride along two and a half. We ain't got enough money for three, as you can see. You have reached your destination, bitch. Uh, okay, we're here. Thank you. <clears throat> yeah, thanks a lot. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for this. We appreciate it. Thank you. Nah, no, I definitely appreciate it. No. No, I thank you. No, no, no. I'm going to give you a double thank you. Oh. You go ahead and get out. I'm going to well, give you a triple thank you. I'm just going to say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you times all thank yous on the planet. So thank you. Uh, well, I'm going to say all thank yous on the universe times all thank yous on the planet. Well, I forgot this. I forgot. I forgot to say thank you. Infinity times infinity. Thank you. Uh, get your ass out. Thank you. Uh, for me, man, I like to drink a lot of coffee when I work. I don't drink coffee any other time. What? I'm doing an interview. I'm doing an interview. That's why I can't work with you. Why don't you kiss my ass, Ice Cube? That's right. They gotta make a choice. It's either me or you. Here's the thing about Ice Cube. He hasn't been right since the accident. Nobody knows about the accident. Uh, Ice Cube has irritable bowel syndrome. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Q, real quick, did you get that message where I was like, thank you? Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Here's for your welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. you know, I love Kevin Hart. You know, not only because we've done, you know, uh, his best movies together. <laughs> <laughs> but because he's just a good dude, you know, and you don't run into a lot of good dudes out here in Hollywood. And uh, I'm just proud to be here with him, standing here, proud of his family, um, uh, his homeboys behind us. We, we just clown all the time. So, hey, hey. thank you. You're very welcome. Like he's the hardest working man in show business. I love him to death. And uh, congratulations, man. Do you get on on set, or is it? Or do you genuinely kind of annoy each other? My best friend. Okay. Say it. <laughs> Say it. Come on, man. Say it. We in the UK. Say it. Let them know how you feel. Best friend touch. Come on, man. Come on, man. There it is. All my friends, last but not least. Yo, I don't get here without you and without your support. I am a representation of what you have made me. I love you all. Thank you so much. Today is an honor. Uh, please, please, don't pee on my star for at least a month. Give me one month. What? Wow. What? <laughs> Gee, gosh, would I love him. A lollipop and a stack of pancakes. Don't get excited. And watch my hair. Guys, do we have a muzzle? Move, move that ball. Yeah, this is how Kevin made it in Santa. The way he moves the ball. Take a lot of balls to the chest. <laughs> how I wonder what you are. Uh, that thing in your back is just a microphone. Hey, you guys want to see an impression of uh of Dwayne the Rock Johnson right now when he's the wrestler? I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do to you tonight. I'm gonna do tonight.
Oh, look how wonky it keeps it. Little, yeah, that means there's a problem. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> this is called dick in a tree. <laughs> 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 Ah. Huh. Stop, man. <laughs> We've got puppies. puppies. Yo, big shout out right now, Central Intelligence promo. But now we had to take it to the streets to all the real motherfuckers out yeah. there. Yeah, this yeah. is for y'all, for the street motherfuckers. The street motherfuckers this is bad. You know what we talking about? Come on. I'm talking about you, T Top. Hey. I'm talking about you, Titty Mac. Hey. I'm talking about you, Roy the Boy. What? I'm talking about you, uh, uh, and Eden, no circumcised Terry. You know what I'm talking what? about. Shout out to you. Dick been in the streets for a minute. Uh, dude, we out here, dude. Tell him, we, we out, out here, here, dude. We word, out here. Word. Where motherfuckers get real dog. Down. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's good. don't mess with me, look. My eyes hurt. Shit. Yeah. yeah. And then? Oh, whoa. If they are intimidated, what would you do? No, he's trying to intimidate you now. That's the look. It's not really working. Yeah, it didn't work. No, no. 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 She said, I like you she too said, much. Said, <laughs> soul gazing. Me. That's DJ. DJ, if he looks yeah. in your soul, you'll melt. Right now. Don't do not do it. Uh. See, you didn't see the latest version. The latest version, oh. he takes off his pants. It's DJ's butt. They didn't yeah. show me that, so I was very disappointed. I was very disappointed. I, was, I didn't mean for that to come out. As soon as I see it, it's it's on my hip. Okay, you know what I'm saying? I'm I'm literally. I, mean, I don't know. The goose is yeah. loose. Is what I'm saying. It's, it's, I'm saying. I'm saying we pitch here, tents. Here's the line. That, then that's where. Yeah. He just uh, went. Okay. There's a tent that need to be pitched. Well, it just got pitched. <laughs> wants to see butt. She just <laughs> wants to see butt. She's a she's a butt lover. Uh, you only got one. Don't say that on camera. Yeah, you're a butt lover. Hey, some women love butt. Camera, that's that's you know. some women are like, hey, this, I want to see butt. Okay. It's a dick joke. It's a dick joke. It was a hard dick joke. Hey. All right, Thanks so for clearing it up, man. Pitching tents. If you under the sheets and you get it wrecked, the sheet go up. It looks like a tent. You see what I'm saying? Oh, yes. 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 Now, I, I won't ask you to, to show me, but okay. <laughs> I'm going to go and say it again now, because yeah. obviously I have to see yeah. the non-PG version. Yeah, we got to so. we, we send you the real version. Yeah. yeah, but I hope everyone else but, gets it. See, she but. said but. See, she said but. It's so bad. It's so bad. I use a butt double. My you butt use his butt. My For butt your is butt. bad. Just use, 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 use a butt use double. Use Dwayne's butt. No, I accidentally <laughs> used the white butt the first time, and I, I didn't know. I can look at a person and go. You can read minds. I know what you're thinking before you say it. I know. <laughs> like right now, you're like. Oh, oh that's. <laughs> Tell me. But this has sinking. Right now, what you're thinking is can he really read my mind? Mm -hmm. Yeah, see that? I, I, I saw it. <laughs> I saw it. <laughs> the Rock has tiny muscles. The Rock has. <laughs> Did he say butthole? The rock says tiny asshole. <laughs> okay, go. All right. Am I black? <laughs> no. All right. Okay. Right. Korean dicks are bigger than you. <laughs> Do you really think that I'm gonna play the flute? <laughs> Did I get it? You get his, his first name is Pedro. Oh! Right? Pedro Martinez. Hey, almost. No. <laughs> no. Listen. Listen. Uh, that shit! Uh, oh my god, remember? Pedro! Oh, why didn't you guys tell me? I got beaten by paper and scissors. This motherfucker just said a whole paragraph. <laughs> <laughs> Give me his voice. Is his voice like. Hey. Okay. Do. Instead of saying you, he goes. Yeah. Do, do. We'll get the uh, letter Z. Oh, Z. Yeah. Yes, yes, Z yes. on your butt. Kevin is just a snack-sized Denzel. <laughs> Kevin sucks a donkey's dog. <laughs> <laughs> I got something like that. But Kevin. Kevin is is a, a snack-sized salad tosser. <laughs> <laughs> salad tosser. Denzel. Sexual salad tosser. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, director who made him famous is Robert Rodriguez. Is that correct? Who made him famous in the States? Uh, yes. 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 Like Pedro. You didn't know Stop that. judging me. No, you didn't no. Know that, Pedro. No. No. Robert Rodriguez. There were people here in Spain. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Pedro. Oh, he, played, okay. he played Zorro. Yes. Got yes. it. Yes. Got it. All right, here we go. You say the word Spanish and we're going to do it. Espia. 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 Chulazo. 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 Well, that's slippers. You got me. That's La slippers. Roca. 
La Roca. La Roca. La Roca. Yeah. Hey. La Roca. <risa> Unicornio. Croqueta. 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 Pimientos del padrón. Pimientos del padrón. Pimientos del padrón. Pimientos del padrón. Hey, what's going on? We are in Spain, Central Intelligence. Hey! Hey! So, some of the similar things that my character went through in the movie, I went through too as well. And But he, he was a, Mr. Popular. He had a, what do you, how do you say it in Spanish? Um, fucked up mustache. Yes, yeah. yes. He had yeah. A, yeah, there you go. He had a, a, what? How do you call it? Bijote. 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 Yeah. Bijote. Yes, yes. yes. He said, uh, hey, no algo, hey, uh, pasa? Uh, oh, uh, that's good. Uh, this is good. Us. Um, yeah. Forever. Yeah. Uh, but, I, 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 but, I, but here's the thing, I will say, I mean, this is good, your Spanish is yeah. so on point, yeah. but I just want to say to all my fans, which is the entire country, uh, I just want to say thank you for all the love and all the support. I'm just going to speak English yeah. because my Spanish is very limited because mm -hmm. the only Spanish I knew is from my old um, Spanish girlfriends. Like, ay, papi. Uh, ay, yeah. muy grande. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what that means. Yo, un poquito. <risa> Tenéis muchísimos proyectos, cada uno, mm. pero habéis elegido para hacer este. ¿Por qué? Ok, you have a lot of projects around it that you could have chosen. You pick this one, why? Ah! Ah! Yeah. Good, you got it? Yeah. Got it. Ok. Uh, pero. Es un escrito. Muy bien. Uh, yeah, uh, fantástico. Caramelo ah. and uh, chocolate. Yeah. Come in. Yeah, yeah. And then uh, uh, also, uh, um, <laughs> como se dice, como se dice chemistry. Como se dice chimera. 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 Best answer ever. ¿Por qué la gente debería ir a ver Yumanji? Bienvenidos a la junta. You you take this one. Sure, pero muy grande, caramelo, and muy grande vanillaito. Uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, shit. No, uh, no, no, <laughs> no, that's not, it's, uh, Ch chocolate. Ch oh, chocolate. chocolate, yes, yeah. yes, and the chocolate. Yeah, chocolate, uh, um, uh, eh, muy bien, um, eh, 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 polo, <laughs> eh, polo poquito, uh, no, no, eh, poquito. polo poquito, no, poquito, anything, uh, muy eh, grande, eh, grande, eh, no, no, eve poquito. No, no poquito. <laughs> yeah. no, 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 uh, no. You know, Jumanji? Grande. Uh, yeah, hey, yeah, Kevin, yeah. Kevin Man, Hart. Oh Kevin Hart. Hey, movie <laughs> macho star. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Another perfect interview. Perfect. Yes. Ah. 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 Hello, friends of Ching Dong Dao. Here we are, Jumanji premiere. The no, junket is. I'm doing it. I just got finished pronouncing the very Oh, no, I'm sorry. Go ahead, then. Well, I can't do it if you're going to. No, go ahead. I'm just. Hello, friends of Ching Dong Dao. Wow, that's. Brother! Brother! 
offensive. But that's not offensive. That's how you pronounce it. Ching Dong Wai That's not. Hello, friends of Ching Dong Dai Chow. Wow. I'm guys, I'm sorry. That's not. I'm sorry, guys. Can we all agree that I'm doing a very good fucking uh, asshole? Oh, naranja. Naranja. What? Como se dice? Como se dice banana? Banana. This is it's a uh, <laughs> bad <barrel>. bit <laughs> What's going on? I'm Kevin Hart, and we are back for season six of Cold as Balls. It gets bigger, and it gets better. You put ice on me, I'll bust your You too. Hey, hey, hey. Yo. What's up, man? How are you? Good to see you, dude. Yeah, Look at you. I'm good. Yeah, right on. <laughs> My God, man, you look good. This is going to be great. Here we go. You can put it right there. Right Hang up, up on the hook. All yep. Right, all right. How's retirement, man? It's good. It's, it's good. good. I thought I wouldn't have to do much more of this. Really? <laughs> yeah. You thought you'd be done with it. Get in, we sit on the back. Okay. Chat it up for a little bit, then we slowly get into the cold tub. I gotta mentally prep a little. Uh, You'll be all right. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. There you go. Come That's on, man. It. It's just the beginning. Uh, guys. Get, oh, come on, stop cheating. Sit on the back. Sit on the back, and you'll make me get all the way in. Yeah, sit on the back. Yeah. Goodness gracious, you tried to jump the I thought we were going in. Not yet. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Welcome to Coldest Balls. I, of course, am your host, Kevin Hart, and today, I'm with royalty. A legend. Sean White is in the building. You're retired now. I'm pretty happy about it, though. Really? Yeah. Is it weird? You know, if it were a traditional sport like football or something, like, it's hard to, like, keep doing that sport. Snowboarding, I can still go snowboarding. Like, you used to enjoy it. it. Did you cry? Was it, like, an emotional? Oh, for sure. I was trying not to, but I got to the bottom, and all my competitors are waiting there, and they were, like, telling me all these stories, how I influenced their lives. That really got me. Well, the crazy thing about you, you've been great the entire time. When I started, there was no Olympics. Like, that wasn't even an option. Mm -hmm. X Games had just started, and it was completely different than what you see today. Mm -hmm. There were, like, really no future in it, and I just loved the sport. You're a part of history. Oh, you're, thanks, you're, yeah. you're a part of <laughs> history when it's attached yeah. to this sport. I heard, at the age seven, you, you had sponsors and then? Yeah, well, that's what was wild. It's like, they didn't even make kids board. My mom took me to the mountain. I was like, I gotta do this thing snowboarding. They rented me a board, but it was giant. And so my mom called Bert and snowboards. I was like, my son, he snowboards. She's probably lying. Like, he kills it. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know, it just so happens we're gonna make kids boards this next season. So why don't you, you know, stay in touch and we'll we'll get him a board. We share, you know, we share similarities and some things. Oh, we do? And, yeah, because you said you were endorsed at the age seven. Yeah. Me yeah. too. Oh. Yeah. What, what for? All right, let's take a quick commercial break. White hand, please. Oh, yeah. This episode of Coldest Boss is brought to you by Old Spice. And of course, I got some new. Oh, it's time to talk about that nourish with avocado oil. Ooh, it's got a lasting scent and plant based hydration. Go get you some. Mm, white hand. Thank you, man. How old are you now, Sean? 35. At the retirement, do you look and go, God, I, like, I'm a little. I'm a little nuts. Yeah, like I know now what's gonna happen if, if things go wrong, cause it's happened and now I have that life experience. Give me your scariest moments. I was in New Zealand, I'm getting ready for my fourth Olympics. I'm having the best day ever. And I'm thinking, all right, today's the day I do this trick that I've been like procrastinating. And right away I take off, I know what's wrong. I'm like 20 feet in the air going, oh great, like this isn't good. <laughs> and so I come down, I hit the wall, and then I bounce and the wall's 22 feet. So I bounce to the bottom and what broke my fall was my face. My forehead was split open. God. My lip was ripped, hung, was like hanging. And this is what kind of scared me. Cause I was like, how bad is it? <laughs> well, you yourself up bad yeah. <laughs> and you can't see it. You're just going off of everybody else's face. Yeah. Oh, well, that right there. Like you don't yeah. want that. Oh, how bad is it? <laughs> oh my God. 
The wildest part is that I made a promise to myself that I wouldn't do that trick until it was perfect. And at this point, we're like two weeks from the Olympics and I'm having a meltdown. I haven't done the trick. I'm terrified to do it. I'm like, I'll just do it when I have to do it. So fast forward, we're at the Olympics. I'm sitting there going like, all right, it's now or never, I gotta do it. And I nailed it. And that was awesome. That was just like one of the highlights. I am going to be honest and tell you that was probably one of the best stories that I've <laughs> All right, Sean, time for us to yeah. get in the tub a little more, okay? okay? We just sit on a stool in the back. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. There you go. Right? That's yeah, good. that's it. Right there. There we go. You had some surgeries too, right? You had open heart surgery. Yeah, yeah. You are a walking survivor, man. Well, it's funny too, because I kind of hid that I had the heart surgeries for the first Olympics, because, you know, they grab onto things in the media, and I didn't want to be like, heart surgery miracle boy does whatever, you know what I mean? I'm like, I don't want that as my title. Heart surgery miracle medical boy. boy. Yes. <laughs> You can see the bit of the scar and the mm -hmm. staples here. But uh, yeah, I had what's called tetralogy of Fallot. I had like uh, leaking valves and things. And, tr tr yeah. tr what? Holy. Hold on. Is this for me? What are you doing? You don't snowboard. <laughs> and what are you doing? You damn sure don't snowboard. Just because you got the board. <laughs> damn. Stop it. Stop it. Sure, I don't know if you noticed or not, but I, you know, I dabble. I dabble on the mountains a little bit. Getting on the on the snow. <laughs> You're pissing me off. Fuck okay. Fuck All right. In. Okay. I know they call it the double black diamond. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm. What do you? Grow the f up. <laughs> you hear me? This isn't even a snowball. It's not even a snowball. This is what you're doing with your spare time, huh? Well, stop it. You in the sport, there has to be somebody that motivated you to get into it. There has to be somebody that acted as a mentor. I would say it would be like Tony Hawk. Ah. I ran into him at the skate park. He lived in the same neighborhood as me. They opened up this awesome skate park at the YMCA. He would be there all the time. And so I go there and I had this fantasy that if like I just skated really well, he might come talk to me. He came up, introduced himself, uh, asked me if I wanted to come to this like skateboarding demo with him. My mind's blown. And after that, just like we became friends. You know? That's insane. Yeah. And he took a liking to you. By the oh, way, yeah. one of the nicest guys and one of the funniest yeah. guys. Yeah, he's a good guy. I like that you yeah. guys are, are very similar. <laughs> if it wasn't snowboarding, yeah. what else could it have been? My dad wanted me to be a surfer. I'm named Sean after Sean Thompson, this like South African surfer. Okay. I'm like, okay, it was like his decision, right? And so whenever you push the kids into things, it's tough. You basically, <laughs> your dad is forcing you to surf. Well, it's tough, I'm picturing, <laughs> when I look back, it's more of a grainy okay. film that's playing out and it was, it was cold and it was storming and he takes me to the beach and drags me out through the surf. And he's like, this is the wave. And this, it's a huge wave. And I'm thinking like, oh my God. How old, how old are you? Five or six. God, yeah, yeah. What do you mean? <laughs> like, Five or six, I thought you'd say 12. I'm yeah, four. yeah. He takes me down there, sends me down the wave. I go under, I try to get air. I get swirled again. Board hit me in the face. I'm oh. like bleeding now. And I'm like, I hate you. That single tear, you know, he, Absolutely. Wanted, he wanted it. Is there another thing that you love too? Oh. I fell in love with playing music. I, I won a guitar at a snowboard concert. You're not, you're, you got a band, don't you? Yeah. You had a band well, I, I had you one had back band. in the day. It was like some friends from the neighborhood and stuff. What was the name of your yeah. band? It was called Bad Things. Were you the lead singer? No, I was like the lead guitar guy. I love that every yeah. time you I was do, in the background. Like, every time you, know, you say it, you do this right here. You get like a little twitch. <laughs> you gotta get that face gun, the like. <laughs> Where were you guys at with the world of one? Like, is that something that you were passionate about? Kind of at one point, we put out like a little album and toured a little, and that was just the best part. Was, what was wild about it is I'd never done like a team sport. Got Snowboarding it. was like, okay, yes. I do this, I do this. And with the team effort, it was crazy because it's like somebody's birthday and this going on. And then I'm like, wow, okay, this is hard to like get everybody on that same motivated, you know, Demo personality. Yeah. yeah. That's dope, man. Yeah. I, yeah. I, had, a, I had a group. Okay. Uh, we had one. <laughs> it was a group called G Bed Night. Like, I'm looking for you, I know you see me too, what you wanna do? I'm trying to f <laughs> It's seven days in a week, but I'm gonna sleep for three, cause I'm trying to f <laughs> I was a virgin, so that was, oh, that, that was, was everything was okay. on my mind. I know you know. What's your problem? 
Alright. You need to relax. <laughs> Sorry, Sean. What do you something? Oh. Oh, uh, oh, we gotta yeah, go in it. deeper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, white hand. We're about to grab a stool. Just give him your stool. Okay. I know when we're supposed to go in. I'm the host of the show. Here we go. Okay. Man. I know, and I'll get. I'll get it. Ooh. Give me a second. Hey, hey, get, get your hand out my. <laughs> Bam. Back up. Back. Take it. Just take it. Go. Give, give it to white hand. Give it to white hand. He don't need your help. There ain't supposed to be two white hands back there. It's only one. He was over yeah. here trying to do too much. That's oh. his problem. I named the hand after you. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Thank you. White hand. Miracle hand. White hand. What, what, call <laughs> Miracle white what hand. happened to the uh, what happened to the hair? Why'd you go? Oh man, I bumped into Carrot Top in Las Vegas. Funny. This is already funny. It was amazing. Oh. And I was like, yeah, I'm thinking about maybe trimming the hair, you know, and he kind of gave me this look like, do it now before it's too late. Like, he's like, I'm stuck like this, but like, there's still time for you. Yeah. So you cut it. What'd you do? What'd you I, do? I ended up donating it. You can donate it to like charities that make wigs for. Who's got the Sean kids. White yeah, wig? I know. Wait a minute. Yeah. You son of a. That beard. You showed up this season with a god beard. You didn't have it before. You son of a. Ain't th that was for the children. Come over here. Get next to Sean. Let me see it. It's the same color and everything. Let oh, me see goodness. it. Goodness, right there. Is that? Oh my God, Sean! Imagined? Well played, well played. How much did you pay for it? It does look nice, though. Top dollar. <laughs> All right, Sean, we're gonna play a little game right now, right? Okay. Basically, gotta name two tricks, and then you gotta make up one, and I gotta tell you the one that is real, and I'll okay. do the same for you. Called two tricks. Two tricks and a lie. Yes. First trick is a front side roast beef. Ain't no guy. Roast beef? That's a lie. That's a trick. That's a trick? <laughs> yeah. The f is that? <laughs> the worst trick. Hold on. What is, what is... <laughs> Back up! Roast beef. Bet that's roast the one that you would love to do. All you want to do is eat. Go ahead, Sean. It's a grab. Ah. It's you grab between your legs on the back edge. Okay, give me another one. Switch. Revert 360. Okay, give me one more. Come on. Front side double cork. 1200. First side double court, 1200 is real. I've done it. <laughs> the middle one isn't real. Cause I would have done it. More I'm, ice. My turn. Guy, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna try. <laughs> All right. All, All the right. tricks sound fake, anyway. I got them. I All gotta right. keep track. Here you go. First one. Yeah. The double back twirl, mm. twirl top tip. I wanna. F <laughs> and the other one is um, the sliding handbag tuck tip mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. with a double dip. And the last one is the journey in the. <laughs> Which one of those is fake? Hoping the last one's fake. Nope. Sure. Nope. Journey in the <laughs> is real. That's real. These are easy tricks. But yeah. what is not easy is accomplishing what you've accomplished. Okay, and we're talking about history. You know, don't fully leave the sport. You gotta go and you gotta keep your hands on these younger people, man, to the best of your ability. Will you? Will you okay. stop? Stop it, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. We learned some more stuff. And I said, even <laughs> so sick of you, man. <laughs> you need to cut it out. I don't know why you would make me do that. Goodness gracious, John. Sorry, I apologize, man. <laughs> You made me do that. You made me do that. I, I didn't want to have to do the double trick, half pipe, double dip. Give me a god boy. Come on, Sean. You okay? Yeah, take that. You don't deserve it. You, you got it. something coming. <laughs>
My God, about time. Yeah, man. It's about time I had somebody real on this show. <laughs> An eagle, that's what I mean when I say real. Mouth, you can go ahead and put your robe up on the hook, man. Got myself a real one. Go it's been, been a while since that, that's Super Bowl. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you got, yeah. Yeah. We can talk about it. <laughs> uh, let's sit on the back, man. You can get in. Oh, you don't got to get all the way in. Just sit on the back. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Kevin Hart. This is a new episode of Cold as Balls. Please welcome Malcolm Jenkins, AKA Mr. Eagle himself. What up with you, champ? What's going on, brother? Man, first thing you said when you saw me, it's been a while, huh, Kev? Since the Super Bowl. What What do you remember before I before I go into what happened? What, what do you remember? So, so I just remember I was upset because, you know, I'm captain of the team. Yeah. We came on this long <laughs> journey. Yeah. Win the Super Bowl. I'm thinking, hey, I'm about to get on the stage and get my moment. Give yeah. me the trophy. Let me hold it up, get all my pictures. I walk to the stairs, ah, the security puts his arm out. I'm like, hold on, I, 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 I can't go on the stage? No, I can't. So I'm, all right, I go back with the rest of my teammates, Zach Gerds and Nick Foles and them on the stage. I'm, I'm humbly just enjoying the celebration. And I, just, and I see somebody jump a little security fence, weeding their way through the crowd and then get to the same checkpoint that I got to. Another hand. <laughs> Except for he was way more persistent than yeah. me. He was really negotiating with the security dude to no avail. First of all, I, let me give you let me give you the full breakdown. All right, you you want to laugh? I'm about to make you laugh. Let me give you the full breakdown, Malcolm. How I even got down there. This is a big deal. Philadelphia is in a Super Bowl. I'm going. Man, we getting this sweet bottles. Bottles of tequila are just are just flowing. And we go trick play, we score on a trick play. I never forget, we're going crazy. I made the announcement in the suite. I said, if we win, we're going down to the field. We. We're going down. Listen, we don't have passes. Act like I, said, I'm gonna, I said, I'm gonna get us through. Just keep walking. All right, done. First door come up. I go through, excuse me. How you doing, Kevin Hart? Hey, how you doing? I'm personality and everybody. How you doing? Hey, good to see you, sweetie. Hey, we did it. I'm, I'm cloud nine. Come on, y'all, let's go. She said, excuse me, y'all coming? They good, they with me. Everybody with me, they with me. Okay, okay. we was just confused. Mm -hmm. They don't know what to say. We get down to the next level. We getting lower. Another door come up. A guy sees me. Oh, Kevin Hart, hey, what's up, man? We did it, baby, give me a hug. He hugged me. I'm personality now. Come on, everybody, let's go, let's go. He like, what? Y'all got passes? Nah, they with me, everybody with me. We going down, we going to locker room. I'm just, I'm just talking fast. <laughs> we end up on the field. I see the trophy. I get to the guy, you know, I'm trying to just go, excuse me. He's like, no, you can't get up here. And I say, yes, I can. <laughs> <laughs> he said, you can't get up here. I'm Kevin Hart. I can't. I'm from Philadelphia. That's what I told him. I'm from Philadelphia. I know who you are, but you can't get up here. Nobody's getting up here. And man, he put the strongest hand on my chest. And I remember saying, this is like when I sobered it up a little bit, because I was like, it's cameras out here. Like, I was like, I said, this ain't going to look good. Somebody else seen that? This camera's all over the place. And you know what? Now that you say it, because Zach was up there in Foles, I think we got a racism lawsuit on our hands. We might. I think the security guard was white, too. Hey, mother f do you want <laughs> I think I'm with the right guy if I want to get this gun. Do you want to get You want to get this good company. <laughs> uh, quick moment to pay the bills. White hand, please. This episode of Coldest Balls is brought to you by Old Spice's new dry spray. I'm talking about ridiculously long-lasting sweat protection. Oh, don't get no better than this. So if you want to do something and you want to sweat, well, this gives you a ridiculously long-lasting amount of sweat protection while you do it. So if you're going to use anything, use this. Right here. Yeah. Commercials are real smooth around here. I like that. Yeah, it's what I've been doing for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> do you think that, uh, that that corner position is the most, is that the most pressured position? It is stressful. <laughs> stressful. <laughs> You know, the thing about playing corner is you give up one play and that play is a touchdown yeah. that everybody sees. Yeah. That one mistake you had, don't let you fall or get broke off. No, that's the move. Corner get broke down, you get scored on corners, I'll do this. They... 
<laughs> the smart ones that do this, like, yeah, where, yeah, they go yeah. do this. Uh, where's my safety? Like, look, you look for somebody. Where's my safety? Smart corners. <laughs> what, what are you doing? I thought you was going. And they start doing this. And this dude. <laughs> yeah. But, uh, <laughs> but I got moved to safety my second year just to get on the field. But one of the things I realized is, like, to play safety in our league, it's a, you got to have the mindset to be able to literally have amnesia. I don't seen many, especially if you play in Philly. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh my I don't seen too many corners in Philly just get destroyed. Oh, my God. I'm on the field. Oh, my God. In the red zone. We, yeah. We're fighting for our lives on the field. What the f is he doing, wall. man? I hear, I hear the crowd talking about one of my teammates. Yeah, just suck. Yeah, just suck. I'm like, oh, what the? We the, home. We're home. <laughs> Uh, at this point, man, me and you, we need to get further in the tub because the conversation is going to so get a little more intense, right? <clears throat> Let's get a little, a little more intense. Oh, get further down in the tub. Um, I also got to take time to throw some flowers your way. You know, your involvement with Players Association and just the movement that you were a part of and the things that you've done. What is it that, that generated your push for you to start to make the changes or want to see the changes? Uh, be made from the NFL. Like pre-2016, guys did work in their own individual charities, right? Mm -hmm. And the more of us that do it, the, the more powerful they are. And so we started to build collectives, actually changing laws, meeting with lawmakers and politicians all around the country, and it's player-led. That's never been seen before. Now, never seen. now we're in over a dozen other professional uh, sports that have come along with us. There's got to be a network that that is... You it's got to be a unified a push. For sure. Was there ever a moment where you said, I'm really considering letting this game go? I mean, I think, I think the further you go, I'm, I mean, I just finished my 13th year. Damn. Don't, don't hit me with that. I didn't, give you, the same time. I didn't give you the same volume. It was close. No, because it wasn't age. It was 13th year. Oh, you called me old head. Well, that's <laughs> right. Oh, you're right. You're right. You know what? I apologize. But 13 years. Damn. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Yeah. Uh, what an interview this has been. Um, and you know, why Why am I even shocked? I'm not, you know, this is Philadelphia. That's what I'm talking to, a Philadelphia group. Got cheese thing, right? Damn it, I, I apologize, my, I apologize. What do you, mm. Mm. guys, mm. Mm. bam, bam down. He don't, he don't play in Philly no more. I'm no, no. Yeah, I don't even eat meat no more. No, okay, he don't even eat meat. He don't play for Philly, and he don't eat meat. The cheese steaks don't mean, it don't mean nothing no more. You got a po' boy back there? Okay, what are you doing? Where are you going, Bam? Bam! Now, stop eating that, you don't. Oh, oh. What you doing? What you got? What? A little crawfish. Okay. That's great. Okay, bam, bam. That's great. Okay. You're not even mixing it at this point. You're just splashing <laughs> me. That's enough. Go. Go over there. What what uh what fraternity were you in? Q Dog. Ah. What do the Q do, what do the Q's say? We bark. Oh, oh, ski. Oh, oh. Ski. No, no. Okay. Don't don't ski. Sorry, man. It's all good. I figured since you was in a fraternity, you should know that. I thought about actually doing it. Everybody thinks about doing it. Yeah, I thought about it, but they didn't, they didn't have them at uh, Community College in Philadelphia. I went to CCP. We didn't have it there. That's the only reason. They had at Temple. I didn't, I, I didn't qualify for Temple because of my SAT. <laughs> Don't, bam. Okay. Is that? What's your problem today? Huh? You on that stuff again? You messing with that sh again? Are you, bam? You're getting tested today. It's in the back. Drink too much in this cold tub. Stop it. Why don't you ever help? Hmm? You ever notice that? That you're the only black person I got on this set and you never helped me? Never. Never have you ever. In front of Malcolm, you do that? Hmm? No, that don't. Okay. No, Daryl. That's just. <laughs> All right. Come on. No. I gotta see. You. I'm sorry. You don't have to do this. We are. Hey, are we brothers? Are we brothers? Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Mother. You thought it was coming from me. That was a setup. 
It was close, Malcolm. I thought he was going to whoop my ass. I was glad he won't right. pass me. I was like, <laughs> Uh, okay, Malcolm, this has been a good episode because I'm talking to an eagle, okay? Even though he's from Jersey, he's affiliated to me. And, and I'm seeing nothing but greatness. Nothing but greatness. And good fraternity fashion, I feel like you and I should step. I was a proud member of Zion Baptist Church's step team. And I'm not sure if you know my history, mm -mm. but I got a little bit. And I know yeah, you Q-Dogs do what you do. You can get there. I'm going to take Bam on my side, yeah, I'm, man. I'm going to go solo. Huh? You're going to go solo. Gonna play, so okay, yeah. then fine. That's fine. Daryl, come over here with me. You can be a part of my step team. The Zion Baptist Church steppers. What an episode. White hand. What an episode this was, man. I wish you had feet, white hand, because I would let you step with me. But you only got a white hand. That would be stupid. For you to do something. Fellas, we're gonna do it real simple, okay? We're gonna go five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna go two up top, three at the bottom. You understand what I'm saying? End it with a curl. And when I say get done, that means you whirl. All right? You understand what I'm saying? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, down. For the Lord. For Jesus Christ is my Savior. What are you doing? What are you doing? Worshiping the devil? Get your stupid to bed. I said, when I go down, you go up. It's embarrassing me in front of him, man. Bam, I got a good mind to knock your ass out. I got a good mind to do it. God, do it. I will. What a guess you've been. Hey. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, guys, this has been another episode of Coldest Balls, and we have been able to fly like nobody's business. Why? Because we talked to an eagle. That's right, for the first time on the show, an eagle, and we flew. Some of us flew for different reasons. Hmm? Yeah, I'm talking about you and that <laughs> Come check your bag, Bam. Daryl, let's go. Separate yourself. Malcolm, get out the tub, man. White hand. Get it there. That crawfish got to come out of there. But you don't know. Bam, I'm going to the bag. Daryl, get to the bag. Get What's going on? I'm Kevin Hart. Right now, you're watching season three of Cold as Balls. Oh, sh. Yes, oh. sir. How are you, sir? Half of me. Half of you. <laughs> Charles up, Oakley. Oh, yes. put your robot okay. hooked up going yes. the tub. Oh, what did I call you? Was it the Enforcer? Force. Oak Tree. Oak Tree. Just get out of the way. Full fledged lunatic. That's what they should have called you. Ooh. Lunatic Oak is what they should have called you. Ah, ah, I... oh, ah. That's because you can't feel your knees no more. <laughs> oh, no, good knees. No surgery. <laughs> can't hurt country. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to an all new episode of Coldest Balls. I'm your host, Kevin Hart. And I got a legend with me today. Thank you, sir. And I got Charles Oakley with me today. First of all, Oak, you look great, man. Yeah, well, you haven't fallen off, you know, like yeah. a lot of your peers. Ooh, a, lot. a lot of your peers is that looking. Looking like duffel bags. Well, a lot of guys say, hey, they put their work in 12, 15 years late, now they can sit back and enjoy themselves, but I think life still go on. Let's talk you, let's talk history, man. Let's talk the game of basketball, the way it was played back then compared to the way it was played now. It was more physical body back then. Okay. You know, you had to build your body for the moment. You go score, you score your defense, you play defense, and you're a hustle guy, you hustle. Now, you watch teams, everybody wants to be a three-four shooter. Mm -hmm. That wouldn't work back in the 80s and 90s. You think the game is uh, is softer today? That's what they want. When you say they want, what do you mean? Are you talking about the fans? Global. Okay, okay. Commission, whoever else. Got you. If you played today, would you shoot three? Oh, I mean, I made, I shot at 33, 34% when I played. Mm -hmm. It was coming in the tail end of my career. But yeah, I mean, I was stretched for. You know, I know that you are, you're still around your legends. You know, you got right. relationships oh, yeah. with the greats. You, Jordan, you know. Patrick, if you guys are together and you're sitting down at the table, it's a conversation pretty much. We would bust all that We get into it, but they don't try because everybody said, well, the older guys hating on the younger guys. Not hating, it's legends. You don't feel like you're in it? I mean, I think I played my game to my ability, mm -hmm. but I made people respect me. It went about, I had to get 20 every night. And then hit the, on the floor, you gonna feel me. There's only a certain amount of people that can relate to that. First of all, I know who you playing with. I play with Mike. I know I won't get no shot. Cause you know Mike I mean? is a gunner. <laughs> Pass the ball, Mike. Well, Mike is Mike. God damn. I didn't mind sacrificing my body for the better of the team. Uh -huh. Give me your top five my versions of what you do. 
Let's take it down a step, man. Yeah. We no. talk. We got a lot of talk. Let's see how this ice feels. Yeah, you know what? Ah! Yeah. Okay. All right. Ah, yeah. All right. Well, you just let me know how it feels. It feels good. You know, but uh, my top five of my type of guys, attitude, you know, I like Dennis Rodman. As a matter of fact, I seen him the night in New York. I was there, LT. So he come up, he said, you know, I don't really, you know, he gave me to shake my hand, so he shook LT hand. You know, he's a hard working guy. You know, he brought a lot to the game. Uh, ben Wallace. Ben Wallace, Dennis Rodman, I'll go you. Uh, I'll definitely say Lambert. You gotta uh, put him in there. I ain't think he was a dirty player. I don't think he was a dirty player. I don't think you're a dirty player. I think the reason why the word dirty gets thrown into it is because of the image and the, and uh, the bravado that's that's going with but see, with your attitude towards the I, game. I ain't never heard no one say I was a dirty player. I just play hard. No, I heard that you will f somebody up. They oh, say, oh, no doubt. They I say Oka smacked the shit. Well, well, oh, yeah, I did that once they did something wrong. Yeah. And once you do something wrong with me, uh, out of line, oh, I'm going to give it to you. Open oh, hand. No I heard, doubt. I heard, Open, close, uh, whatever. I know you and Chuck. You and Chuck yeah, have Chuck, had some yeah, legendary, had battles. legendary battles there. They going to get the ball 20 times, 25 times a game. I might get the ball 10. So my thing is, don't let them get their 30 points. Make them get 18 and 16, you know? Mm -hmm. Tell us player you played against. Biggest, Shaq. Toughest. I ain't going to say tough. Nobody? You're not going to get it. Carl I, Malone, you're not going to get that? I ain't giving it to him. That country got that. He cried too much. Man, man, man. Breaking news. Mailman was a crier. Yeah, he cried. Crying mailman. <laughs> Where are you at with Patrick? You guys still close? I'm kind of mad at Patrick. Why? What's going on with you and Patrick? No, I just spoke. What happened in New York? He never spoke up for me. Really? Yeah, he had four or five chances to speak up for me. Mm -hmm. And I had his back for the whole 10 years. And I mean, he texts me, you know, every now and then, but I deserve more than text. You're big on loyalty. Well, have some balls off the court. Yeah. A lot of guys don't have balls off the court. I want to talk about the layup. Oh, the finger roll against Indiana? The finger roll oh, against yeah. Indiana. The I mean, that happens. Some stars get breaks. Mm -hmm. And I think one thing about he was consistent in New York. He stayed out of trouble, didn't do a lot, but we missed that layup. No, that was tough. It's like missing a free throw. Well, you're 7 12. You shouldn't finger roll the ball anyway. Yeah, you're right. You should have dunked the guy <laughs> basketball. I'm the guy that yeah. always say what you yeah. did. I don't know why they're not just dunking the goddamn ball. All right, you know what? Come on. We wasted time. Let's go, Chuck. Ah. Let's go. All the way down, get the stool out. Black Hand, you back there? Be careful, Black Hand. Oka smacked the shit out you. That's what he's known for. So. Yeah. He's just a hand. Ain't nobody back there. It's just a hand. You know when I played, they had these in the, in the locker room? Yeah. I never got in one. Really? This is my first time. Why did you never get in tough? You never got hurt? You never got hurt. So you saying you're not human is what you're saying? I got hurt, but back in our era, you had to play hurt. Okay. Pull a hamstring, groin, fingers broke. Not like now. They take two months off that. Yeah, you say these guys today are bitch. Yeah, yeah. Well, Remember me? Well, we called all the players bitch today. Oh, no, we heard some other guys call players that too. The difference in today is the luxury. The way these guys are taking care of their bodies now, it's coming from science and sh Some games, I just eat like Turkish sandwiches and a bag of chips. <laughs> uh, I don't like hotel food, so I, I just go to a Burger King and get a double burger and some french fries. Swear to God. Here's a story that, that I heard. I want to know, know if this is accurate, man. Is it true? They say MJ. MJ used to come and he would take y'all out the night before the game. Get y'all steak dinner, try to get y'all good drunk, and then show up the next day. And that was another reason why he was just cooking. No. No? Rumor. Some of that, that's different. Maybe me and MJ get together, not everybody else. Okay. Me and MJ would get together, we'll sit around, play Tonk, Spades. What got me close to me, him real close is one time we was in Seattle, MJ twisted his leg in practice. And so that night we got together about five guys went to dinner. So all the guys were like, yeah, MJ, yeah, you know, you should pick up the check. MJ like, y'all get a check just like me. Yeah. They got kind of mad because MJ wouldn't take the check. The guy wanted to fight him. I'm like, man, you can't fight the man. You stepped in there. I stepped in. You were fighting ever since did then. Did you step in, step in, bop, bop, or did you step in with words? Or was I it a big thing? We just got tight, though. He just took a liking to me. I mean, look, we're sitting here, we're talking about enforcers, right? Yeah. And I mean, the word enforcer is now a word because of the way that you enforce. So I felt it was only right to give us our own enforcers today. Okay. okay. Give your enforcer. Daryl! Yeah, Daryl. Okay, stand right there, Daryl. Show him so you can see what he's doing. Yeah, Daryl, act like you smacking somebody. Yeah, yeah, mother. Okay. You gotta do it quick. Yeah. Yeah. No, nah, that's two foot back. You gotta go, yeah. 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 You gotta come hard though, look. Yeah, a little harder. 
Yeah. Yeah, I don't I don't want you now. You you his enforcer. So you go stand next to <laughs> you go stand next to Oak at the scene in a way that you would enforce. Darren, have you ever smacked anybody? I mean, come on, man. God, maybe you're not right-handed. Did you do it with the wrong hand? Are you left-handed? That was bad. Come on, Bam. This is my enforcer. Bam, Bam! Ah, yeah, okay. Okay. yeah, okay. yeah. Look at this guy. Yeah. Look at that. Ah, okay. Yeah. Ah. Hey, Bam, let me see your smack. How would you smack somebody? Bitch, if I got to... What? Okay. I said get my money, bitch. Get out, huh? Bitch. Like the burger. Get my money. Bam, bam, come in my corner. You're my, okay. you're my enforcer. You got some weight behind you. Yeah, yeah. So let me tell you the job of an enforcer. You make sure the star don't get hurt. You hear me? So basically, I'm about to say a bunch of stuff. And that means it's your job. <laughs> it's your job to make sure that he don't do nothing to me. If he come, that means you got to come with the thunder. All that stuff you was just doing, you got to do it to him. Get ready. Because I may smack this motherfucker right here on cold as balls. You understand what I'm saying, Bam? Because sometimes, oh, I just yeah. don't give a f No. I'm going to start off by saying, f you, man. That's right. F you. Go ahead. I ain't scared of sh Man, where the light? We, our production lights are going, Bam. Everything went. God, that How tall are you? It really went to sh when he stood up, man. What? You're not seven feet. <laughs> where were you at, Daryl? You could have jumped on his back with that stupid ass smack that you put on display. I can't wait till this go viral so you can see what you look like. Stupid. Are you gonna get down here with me? Get low. Get low. And tell yeah. the songs like get low. Easy. Done. Get low. Done. Come Just on, get on down there. Yeah, no, no. Oak said I'm Come on, get low. Yep. <sighs> okay. Okay. I got some questions to ask you. Okay. I'm yeah. listening. How many seasons did I play? 13. Six off, sir. Oh, sh no pushback today. Thank you, ma'am. All right, all right, all right. Hey, Daryl, whatever you do, double mine. You better do it. He said double it. Smack that good, box good off your head. Good job. What pick was I? Well, I got to get, get this right. Mm. Okay. Uh, reason why I got to get this right because the last thing we want is to get smacked. That's the good thing about having a group. So if I get smacked, we get smacked. You would pick number 13. Wow. I went top six, 10. Six. I went top 10. Seven is what it was. I remember it was eight. No. It was, I thought it was nine, wasn't it? Where was we at? Nine. Nine. Yes. Yeah, that's what I said. He said devil it, Daryl. You're going to get your mustache knocked off your lip. Enough of this uh, of the fast questions, OK? What I want is to have an enforcer, and what I want to do is enforce. The last thing I'm gonna do is be afraid on my show, on my show. This is cold as balls, and right now I'm just that. I'm cold and I got balls. And bam, what we gonna do is put our enforcer into the test. So Charles, I meant it when I said it. <laughs> you, oh, oh, wait a minute, give me a second, give me a second, oh, give me a second, give me a second. Bam, God damn. Oh my God, hold on. Where the f did bam go? Hey, I wanna talk to you, man. What, yeah, uh, what you well, listen, you cook, right? Oh, what, you got a Timberland boot on your head? <laughs> 